The next scene shows Tommen's mother Cersei talking with Marjorie as they watch Tommen be crowned. Although Marjorie is Joffrey's widow, Cersei recommends Marjorie be with Tommen while stating he will need help at the top of the throne and not considering herself as her son's helper. Marjorie is well aware that being married to Tommen would give her and her family an incredible and competitive advantage over the other houses in the Seven Kingdoms. If Marjorie is successful in convincing Tommen to marry her, the alliance will surely help her family become much stronger and more powerful. Marjorie then uses her skills in negotiation to win Tommen over and convince him to marry her specifically through seduction. She applies the acquired needs theory in order to win power and achievement within the Seven Kingdoms. She is extremely motivated in her risky attempt to try and convince Tommen to marry her in order for her to become queen once more. Although this is a risk for her, it is a moderate risk which she is willing to take in order to have the power that almost anyone born in a royalty family seems to want universally.